I'm going to teach you courage. Teach you how to say yes. So you can confront your weaknesses, confront your sins. You will swim across an ocean of pain and emerge free. Now that I know Hudson is alive, I'm more motivated than ever. This confessing your sins thing, everybody has some kind of sin. And John is using that to cover up for his sick fantasies. I swear I'm going to get Deputy Hudson out of there. And I'll tear down everything John C. loves if I have to. He wants me to show him wrath. He's got it. They say you should never meet your heroes, but I met John C. We're not getting the alarms this time. Come on! I'm coming. Can't get to a safe spot. Just stay low until I can get to you. Oh, great, more of them. with their fire. I'm getting hurt here. I'm heading this way. Oh, 
Should have expected this at the compound. Gosh. God damn it. There's two more up in the building. Grenade! That did not sound like a grenade. I think there's just a couple left over there. John, there's hope for the others. Loud and clear! I'm ready, go. The unsanctioned nuclear testing off the coast of Asia continues. Although most countries in the region have agreed to abide by the nuclear weapons ban, North Korea was not one of them. Washington is trying to convince our allies in the area to exert pressure to stop the testing. Okay, I guess I'm flying a plane today. No problem. Gotta keep fighting, man. I don't know what we would have done if we lost that plane. You should be 
coming to a big fork in the river. Hang right. Okay. Yeah. Takes a certain kind of man to defend his home. Between you and me, I'm not sure if I fit the bill. I don't know if you got any little monsters of your own, but I'm telling you, the thought of leaving mine fatherless puts the fear of God in me. And mine ain't even born yet. If running means I can protect my family at the cost of losing my home, so be it. That's the right move, ain't it? Ah, uh, uh, yeah, I don't know. Now, people say landing is the hardest part, but I'll show you how to do it just right. Okay. Get the runway in front of you while steadily lowering your altitude. Slower. Slower. Awesome landing, partner. Bring the plane to me. You'll see me waving. Oh, thank God. Wasn't so hard. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at her. Son of a bitch, you did it! You did it! Thank you! Kim! The plane's back! Hey, come on, let's turn her around. Come on, grab on. <laughs> you know, this is the first time in a long time. I feel like shit's actually going my way. Those damn Peggies. Jim, come on! Please tell me they didn't fuck with her. You know, this plane's been in my family for three generations. Can you believe that? Kim, you coming? Yeah, I'm coming! I swear, that woman sometimes. Anyway. My grandpa first got it when he got back from World War II. It was his pride and joy. I made a few modifications over the years. Kim, would you just hurry up? What? Those motherfuckers, they just won't let up. Jesus Christ. Listen, I'm better in the air, but you are a fucking beast on the ground. I'll hit him high, you hit him low. What do you say, partner? Hoorah! Jim, you stay inside till I get back! Kim, we're leaving. No. No? No. Come on. This is our home. 
Kim, you just don't understand. Don't understand what? That they're stealing our land and kidnapping our friends and doing God knows what else? Kim. Nick, your grandfather built this place. You really want to turn your back on that? And what about all the times you talked about handing off the business to our daughter? Oh, I talked about handing off the business to our son. You've seen the ultrasound. It's a girl. Well, that was on a messy black and white TV screen. You know them things ain't reliable. Nick. I love you. Me too. Well, deputy, looks like the Rye family's digging in. Hey, listen, if you need any air support, you give me a holler. Hey, you and me, you'd be like Butch and Sundance. Nick, they both died at the end. Ah. Oh. Please take care of him. 